Hello everyone, it's Claw Nation here with another video. And for this one, we're gonna kill this um little zombie. We're gonna let it explode. Um and go into the room so it doesn't explode on you or Billy. And we're gonna do the same in this room. Yeah, this is gonna be the end of this part. Sorry if the volume is not showing up for this game my volume cut out a little bit so it went like for some reason it just cut out um for this video so now we're going to switch to rebecca and we're going to go ahead and grab this um handle after the zombie exploded okay and make sure they're about to explode because if you leave the the room without them about to explode you will be um they will be still in that room. Wow, this mic is really, really good, but really touchy. It could catch anything that it wants, like even outside, if like a car is driving by really fast, making loud noises, this mic catches it. Wonder how you fix that, but oh well. Hopefully that doesn't annoy anybody that has that happen. My previous video, my dishwasher was going off so for this one we're just going to finish up playing this part um, should be almost done with this whole part it should be about an hour or so so let's go ahead and enter this lead Billy out there after he played the piano and grab the battery Ah, oh, yeah, battery. And then once it shuts, we're gonna have an old good Billy play the piano again because he is a. He just knows how to play the piano like an angel. That's just who he is. Bada beam, bada boom. And then, um. Don't think, um, just go as Billy, call Rebecca, and we're going to exit this door. Today I'm going to be publishing a lot of videos, so, um, because it's my day off, I'm able to publish a lot of videos. Um, no, Rebecca, we're not going to shoot some leeches with your magnum. And then go into this room. So, yeah. And then we're going to... Enter this room, and there should be some zombies in here. Um, just kill them with the magnum. You have infinite ammo, so why not? Shoot him in the head. So. I already finished all my parts. I am just, um, editing now. Um, adding some voiceover so you guys get some no commentary. So far, I think my with commentary is more popular, but, you know, there could be some people that just prefer no commentary. So, then let's exit this after grabbing the tablet. And make sure you grab the tablet, because once you unhinge it, then on the tablet will fall. It won't count as you grabbing it. So grab the tablet. And then we're going to go ahead and exit the blue door. We're almost done with the training facility. Um, now we're going to go ahead and grab the last tablet and then we should be done. We don't have that much stuff to really grab so we're just going to be continuing onward. Okay, now we're going to go into the front of the mansion, um, leave Billy by the door for a quick getaway, and then we're going to go ahead and place the battery in here. Yeah, the good old battery. 
and then we're going to go ahead and activate the lift and we're going to have Rebecca push the box all the way to the tablet that we need to grab and after doing that switch to Billy and then become a team and leave um, and then we're going to go ahead and go to the tablet room I'll see you guys there um, just pretty simple just push this box um, once the camera angles work for me and we're going to grab that tablet Let's regroup. Roger. Okay, after killing those cockroaches, we're going to go ahead and grab this hookshot and we're going to go ahead and enter the tablet room. If you watch my other playthroughs, you practically know how to get through some of this stuff, but um, let's go ahead and go down the stairs and give the tablet a good put in. Okay, one tablet at a time. And um, I would say this for every playthrough. Make sure you have everything you need because once you put the tablets in, this whole thing's gonna turn around and then it's gonna be miles away. And you'll just take a lot of damage trying to get back to where you're at. But so far we don't need anything besides the hook shot. So now we're gonna continue on through this and we're gonna go fight the bat boss. Let's go, Billy. Let's go fight the Bat Boss. And we're going to fight the Bat Boss as Rebecca to get the All Bosses trophy for Rebecca. So that's what we're going to do. Okay, Billy, go ahead and step on that little pressure plate and Rebecca's gonna go ahead and make sure she has the um, magnum, the magnum or the grenade launcher works. I'll hey, go. Billy, I said stay. Go back. Okay, now let's go ahead and enter this door. Perfect. And now let's go ahead and enter this door. We're not going to save and we're not going to grab anything. You just have to enter this door and then leave for the bat to appear. So that's what we're going to do. Now leave. Make like a tree and leave. Okay. 
Now for this bat bass, bat boss. You want to shoot it, um, keep on aiming, um, keep on aiming towards the boss, so you have to re-aim, you can. Um, you're probably going to get hit quite a bit, sometimes you won't, but the bat almost picked me up, so that was a close one. Um, and now we're going to go ahead and use the hook shot right here. Sorry, my nose is stuffy. It's quite annoying how stuffy my nose is right now but here we go we're going up up and away and then let's use this ladder but stuffy nose won't get me away from doing my videos today so here we go and I'm going to have new content coming out so please subscribe if you want to see more content with video games because trust me I got more plans on the horizon uh, and now and it's going to be more than just doing Platinums now. So, turn on that switch. And then we're going to enter this door. And once you enter this door, we're going to go ahead and call Billy. And we're going to go into this elevator. Come on, Billy. Let's go into this elevator. You stay here. Okay. Okay, now make sure Billy stays right there. And we're gonna use the hook shot as Rebecca right here. Um and in the man in the training facility you did get some green um chemical. But if you didn't, don't fret. There is green chemical in here. Um first we don't need to kill this guy because then he will explode and you probably won't get away in time. So we're just gonna go around him. We won't be coming back into this room anyways. We won't be coming back into this room anyways. And now, go ahead and leave. Perfecto. Go ahead and open this. Press the button. Bailey, I have a surprise for you. It's another Mimicry Marcus for you. And then we're going to go ahead and enter here. And right here. Make sure you're on this side. Because if you go near the zombie on the ground that could grab you. Um, it will wake up two other zombies in this area. Um, one by Billy and one for by Rebecca later. Um, but grab that red chemical to make a stripping agent. Don't go by that zombie on the ground over there. Um, Cause it will wake up two other zombies and you don't want that. Now let's go ahead. And the zombie that's right by Rebecca would be one of the ones that wake up. I believe it's that one. So. And then we're going to go ahead and combine this. Combine that with that. Now I'm going to go ahead and give that to Billy. There's a green chemical over there, so if you don't have one, there's one right by that door. Okay. Now let's give Billy this thing. Okay, and then switch to Billy. Now Billy, let's go ahead and grab this leech charm, or leech, yeah leech charm, 
Now Bailey's going to fight this Mimicry Marcus. You can just blow him up with your rock, with your grenade launcher. Yeah, just blow him up. And then, um, since he's on fire, he'll die like that. He won't blow up if he's on fire. So that's why we use the napalm rounds usually, because it's easier. Now go ahead and use this, and we're going to go ahead and grab the green leech charm. Let's go, Billy. Let's grab the green leech charm. First things first, we're going to pick up this little thing, the little input coil. We're going to need that. Ah, oh, Billy, doing some light reading. Now let's go ahead and enter here. And then we're going to blow up that zombie just to make it easier for us. And then we're going to grab this green leech charm. Rescue mode is going to be practically the same as this playthrough. It's just we're going to be using the death stare. Um, but we are going to save it also because I'm going to show you that you could get um, no healing for that playthrough too. Uh, but it's mostly the death stare where you play as rescue mode. But you have to play rescue mode to get um, one of the costume trophies. Um, the team rescue trophy. So... Um, because you can't get that without being Wesker mode. But we're going to get the rocket launcher at the end of this. And then that should be it with the weapons. Okay, now we're going to give Rebecca the green leech charm. Yeah, the green leech charm. Perfecto. She's just standing there waiting for the green leech charm to appear. We're almost done with um, this little little mini area. Okay, green leech charm it is for this door. Let's enter. And then go um, get away from the zombie that's on the ground that could grab you and then shoot the zombie that's on the ground right there. And then we're gonna grab this. Yes, that's something we're going to need. And then let's exit. And then we're going to go ahead and exit through here. And then we're going to grab a key that we're going to need. Okay, and this time the zombies are going to wake up. Um, since you have infinite ammo, I will just shoot them. Um, so, just shoot them. Practically. Okay. There we go. And you can grab that red chemical if you want. I think I forgot about it. But there is a red chemical later on that we're going to need to grab then. Um. But there we go. Um, grab this key. And then exit. Shoot that one. Since I aimed onto that, shoot that one. And then stay away from that zombie on the ground. And then we're all good. Pop it. Now we're going to go ahead into the next room. And this is where two hunters are. This is the worst part of the game in my opinion. Because um, the hunters could just attack you right away. Right when you get into their position. Um, 
So I'll be just try to be careful. Yeah, see, I got hit. It doesn't matter that Rebecca is um, caution right now because um, with infinite ammo, you probably won't get hit at all the rest of the playthrough. So I'll take my chances. There we go. And then we're going to come back here. We're going to give this thing to Billy. Okay, Rebecca, we'll go ahead and grab this last input coil. And we're going to use the hook shot for the final time with this part. Let's go. Perfecto. Okay. Um, no, wrong way, Rebecca. We're going to use the hook shot right here. There we go. And now we're going to use the input coils and then we're going to drop the hook shot. And then we're going to go meet up with Billy.
Okay, make sure Billy has the grenade launcher and Rebecca has the Magnum. And now we're going to try to go into the train. And we're going to kill the Magmacry Marcus with our Magnum. I dodge him first. I keep on dodging him so he doesn't hit you. And there we go. We're going to make sure he's about to blow up and then climb the ladder. Because if you don't do that, he'll be back down there and you're going to have to restart shooting him so he could um, blow up. Okay, now we're going to input the input coils and then enter the train car. Let's go. Once entered here, we're going to go ahead and, um, Rebecca, why are you exiting the train car? Come on, Rebecca. Go back. We must enter. And we're going to go ahead and, um, pick up the Magnum for Billy later. Perfect. The Magnum. And every boss is practically going to just die really easily with the Magnum. So we are set and golden. Perfect. And now we're going to go ahead and exit the train car. We're practically in the last area now where this is a home stretch. About 30 more minutes left. Okay. Now we're going to go ahead and go up. And enter here. If you guys join my videos, please let me know down in the comments. Because I'm not sure how many people really watch my videos all the way through as much. Um, I'm just curious. If you made it this far. Now we're going to go ahead and enter this door. And we're going to go ahead and um, grab a key for um, a computer later. And right here, um, hunters will show up. I recommend just killing them. There's no point in trying to run past them when they die with one hit from the Magnum. Like that. So you really won't get hit for the rest of the time. Because everything's so easy with the Magnum. Even the final two bosses. So. Now we're going to go back up. And we're going to go in here. And we're going to use the key on this computer. And then we're going to go ahead and exit.
Okay, go ahead and grab this key. And now we're going to go ahead and fight a boss. And this is the first time we're going to fight the tyrant. But he's going to die pretty easily with the magnum. So. Not a big threat to us. Yeah, just keep on shooting him. He won't be able to hit you. I think he's down already. Just like that. He went down pretty easily. Not a big threat to us at all. Perfect. And then we're going to go ahead and head to the fourth floor. Fourth floor. Here we go. Okay, right through here. And now we're gonna go ahead and turn on the lights, the power. We're gonna do this little puzzle right here. Okay, change points. We're going to go ahead and do the fifth one down right there and then we're going to do the second one on the top and then the fifth one down on the next column there we go and just like that the power has been restored just like that now we're going to go ahead and take the elevator. And now I'm going to mention this since we're in the final area. If you see a frog jump at you, shoot it so it doesn't hit you. Um, kill these zombies because they die in one hit. Um, usually I'll recommend um, them hitting you, but since you have the magnum, you can kill it really fast. Um, if you run away from it, it will kill you instantly, and you don't want that, because then you'll have to restart. So remember, when a frog jumps at you, shoot it. Dead. Shoot it dead. I shoot him. Um, if you're not careful enough, he could hit you, but... Yeah, I'm still in caution. Perfect. Now we're going to enter here, and now we're going to just going to go all the way to Billy, so follow my lead. Um, just kill everything that you see, practically. Okay, with Billy, we're going to give him one of the Magnums, the one that we got off the body, the Magnum Revolver, we're going to keep with Rebecca, get rid of the Grenade Launcher, and now we're going to go ahead and enter this door. And we're going to go ahead and 
go to the next room, which is going to be very annoying puzzle. Um, I think it's one of the worst puzzles in the game. It's very, very annoying. Um, but we gotta do it. Have Rebecca go right here. And then we're gonna have Billy go ahead and push some hard, some heavy objects around. So right here, we're gonna go ahead and climb up here. And then we're gonna jump down. Push this metal crate to the very end. Climb on top of here, switch to Rebecca. And then rotate right. There we go. Rotate right. And then we're going to hop down here. And we're going to push this to the very, very end. The very, very end. There we go. And then we're gonna hop on top of it, or hop over here. No, don't push it, Billy. Hop on top of it. And then we're gonna hop down and push this to the very, very end. Man, this game's pretty slow. And then we're going to have Rebecca rotate it right again. Or left, it doesn't matter for this portion of it. And now we're going to go ahead and push the next crate. Switch to Billy. And we're going to push this all the way to the end. And then push it to the edge. Make sure it's at the very, very end of the edge. Like touching the wall right there. Then we're going to rotate it right. There we go. Perfect. And then we're going to switch to Billy. And we're going to push it to the very end. And then we're going to have Billy climb out of here. And that will be it for the annoying ass puzzle. There we go. And then we're going to climb out. And then we're going to go ahead and activate it. And we're going to go ahead and fill up the um, thing and then I will leave um, Rebecca right there and have Billy pick this up and then um, sometimes I just switch to Rebecca um, really fast to have a quick exit and then call Billy over and then exit perfect Wow, about an hour and 40 minutes, so we're really good on time. We're almost done. About 20 more minutes left of this playthrough. Then we're going to go ahead and go up the stairs. Exit. And there's a zombie there. Um, once the mimicry markers dies, um, a zombie will appear there. Um, now we're going to go ahead and put that in, and we're going to enter this little door. Perfect, and the zombies here, I'll kill them. Oh. 
Oh man, I got trapped up by the zombie. Okay, I'm gonna shoot that one, make sure they're all dead. And then we're gonna climb up here and grab the red chemical because I forgot it in the previous area. So, so we're gonna go ahead and grab the green, the red chemical. We're gonna have Rebecca go over there. There we go. And then we're going to exit. Now that we have the red chemical, that's what we need for now. Then we're going to go as Billy, and Billy's going to go ahead and enter this door. Kill these hunters before they get you. Magnum works really well, especially infinite ammo, it's crazy. Now here, um, I'm not going to grab anything. I'm just going to leave. We don't need anything. We don't need no healing. We don't need no saving. We are doing great. And then we're going to go ahead and go down these steps. Perfecto. We only have three more bosses left, so... I'll let you know when. Um, if a frog hops out here, shoot it. Um, no frog came out, which is good. Um, it's always random when a frog jumps out, but never run away from it, because it can kill you instantly when you run away from it. Um, here, we're just going to let, we're going to kill these zombies, and then we're going to just let Rebecca go down that elevator. Okay, Rebecca, go ahead and go down the elevator. Billy will wait right here. And this is where we're going to fight the next boss. And this boss is one of the tyrants. Um, he um, will really not pick up a fight. Um, so, just keep on shooting him. He goes down for the count. Perfect. And now he's down. Once the music stops, you know he's dead. So, you know you're dead. Now drop this ladder. And go ahead and climb it. We're climbing the ladder. And after climbing the ladder, we're going to go down here. And we're going to grab the motherboard. I don't know why I went all the way around. I could have just went the other way. Why am I going back around? I don't know. I am such a weirdo. Now we're going to go back to Billy. Or, yeah. Now we're going to go ahead and use the motherboard right here. And we're going to activate it. And we're going to go into this crate right here. No, Billy, you can't go in. It has to be Rebecca. Rebecca. And then we're going to turn off the water.
Now right through here, we're gonna go ahead and grab this and the blue chemical. First, the blue chemical, mix it with the red one to make a sulfuric acid. And then the industrial water. And we're gonna combine them to make battery power. Perfect. Now we're gonna go ahead and go down the stairs. And we're gonna go turn go as Billy down the elevator. Now right here, there's always going to be a frog right here, so we're going to go ahead and go and then shoot it. And now he's dead. Now run. Perfect. We're so close to the end. Shoot these zombies over here. There we go. I'm pretty sure there's still one more. Yeah. One more right there. Perfect. Now we're going to go ahead and grab the battery next. Come on. There we go. And now we're going to have Rebecca come over here. And we're going to go ahead and grab the battery. Okay, now we're back and we're gonna go ahead and grab the battery, or uh, put the battery in and then don't activate the forklift yet. Have Rebecca go up there, go alone and um, go ahead and lift it up. And once she grabs the key card, don't have Rebecca come down yet because once she comes down, a frog will appear. So just go as Billy first. And once you get to the door, call Rebecca and then enter. Roger. And now we're going to go ahead and go straight to the boss. Let's go.
Okay, once you use the key card, you'll be here. And once you're here, we're gonna go ahead and um, this box is gonna go down pretty fast. So um, make sure Billy's on idle. Um, you can actually have him on attack if you want, but I'm practically just gonna let Rebecca do all the damage. I actually don't have him on attack because I'm not sure if he kills the boss. It won't count towards the trophy. So I have him on idle and then start shooting the boss. And you just keep on doing that until the boss is dead. Very, very easy. Just like that. And now the boss is gone. Just like that. Now go ahead and grab the keys. One for Billy, one for Rebecca. And now we're going to use it on the door so we could go fight the final boss. And then we're done. And then we're done with this playthrough and then a bunch of trophies are going to pop. Okay. And then have Roger. Billy go to... Okay. Wait, Rebecca. You go back. Have Billy go to that one. And have Rebecca go to this one. And now we're going to go ahead and fight the final boss. We don't need to grab anything in here. Um, we're just going to go ahead and do it. Okay, now with this boss, we're gonna go ahead and um, shoot it with Rebecca. Um, just keep on shooting it. Just like that, until it gets to the part where you have to play as Billy. There we go. Now go as Billy. Okay. We're going to exchange that because this one works way better than the one Billy had. And then we're going to go ahead and just shoot it. Just distract it the whole time. Just keep on shooting it. It's okay to get hit. Billy's not even in caution at all. So it will take a lot of hits for him to die. So, and just protect Rebecca. That's practically all you have to do is just keep on shooting it. That's all I really do. Let's go.
There we go, now he's dead. I just kept on shooting him. Um, just move around where he's not in Rebecca's way practically. Um, that's what I usually do. But there we go, I beat it without saving. And I beat it without healing at all. So, there we go, we got a lot of trophies here. Let's see what we got. See our trophies. S is for stars. You got the herb. Save your prayers. Allergic to first aid spray. This is serious business. And that's officer chambers for you, to you. So, and now we got one more trophy I believe should pop. Yes, I could shoot you know. We got the last weapon. Perfect. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this walkthrough for this part. And I hope you guys like and subscribe. Um, go ahead and save it anywhere you want. So, there we go. Please like and subscribe. Support my channel as best as you can. And I can publish more content for you. Peace. Subscribe.